some strangers Winking on my feet Then I see the moonlight Sparkling in your eyes Oh, my body's frozen And my soul's on fire Just follow me, baby Pulling at me with a foxy moon Gently come over My body's a boat
Hello everyone! Welcome to the Nail Tip Show. My name is Tiffany and here we go over and we show you guys so many different nail designs and nail tips and nail art techniques to help you become a better nail artist, a better nail technician so you can get your monies in the salon. Um, if you guys missed out, on Tuesday we, we uh, did a uh, tips application tutorial video. Now that was a little something different we normally do here, but if you guys liked it and you guys joined in, let us know how it went and give us a tip on something you, that's something that you learned that was new so that our um, uh, viewers can actually learn something too. Um, today we're gonna go back to doing our nail art design. So we're gonna be doing a little bit more like tie dye, but we're gonna do do it with dip powder. So if you guys didn't know also, we are going to be here Tuesday and Thursday, starting between 7.30 and 8 p.m. I know it's kind of a weird window, but sometimes we just need a little bit time just to set things up so we don't have any technical difficulties when we go live to show you guys all of our knowledge. Um, throughout the show, I'm gonna be um, looking at my phone on uh, making sure that if you guys have any questions, I can read them off for you guys. Uh, we have viewers from Facebook and on YouTube. So if you guys have not already, please subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you haven't already, um, like, our, like our page on Facebook so you never miss out on any of our videos. If you are a new viewer tonight, please comment down below where you're watching from. We always love to see where you guys are watching from because it allows us to see um, who's watching and what time you guys are watching because so many guys, so many of you guys are watching from different time zones and it's so fun for us. Um, please feel free to engage with us on our chat because we love to answer any questions that you guys have. Um, and I think that's it. We're, I think we're going to get started. Um, here I'm going to introduce um, our nail technician for always, um, <laughs> Ann Ching. Hello everyone, em chào các bạn đến với chương trình The Nail Tip Show Facebook Live và YouTube Live hàng tuần vào ngày thứ ba và thứ năm khoảng chừng 7 giờ rưỡi. À, hôm nay anh sẽ cũng chia sẻ với các bạn một cái uh, dipping technique. À, em thấy có um, dipping cũng là một cái service trong salon. Em thấy bây giờ cũng rất là thịnh, nhiều người, uh, nhiều khách càng thích làm dipping. Thì uh, hôm nay em sẽ chia sẻ vài cách làm sao làm cho dipping mà giữ cái, cái structure và giữ cái um, cái móng nó chuẩn nhất là cho những móng dài là tại vì tiếp viên các bạn cũng nhiều người cũng hỏi là làm sao cho cái móng nó vừa chắc vừa đẹp thì hôm nay em sẽ chia sẻ và cũng làm dài cái um, uh, um, kind of like tie dye nail art uh, um, thì hôm nay em sẽ cho các bạn coi là tiếp viên nó cũng rất là phong phú là tại vì thực ra ngày xưa người ta chỉ làm móng là một màu hay là là ombre nhưng mà bây giờ càng ngày uh, dipping càng rất là chuẩn nên nhiều orders cũng ra nhiều kiểu mẫu rất là đẹp thì hôm nay em sẽ cũng chia sẻ với các bạn một cái tie dye thì hôm nay em đã em cũng có uh, hai ngón tay và em đã cũng làm rồi thì bây giờ em sẽ uh, chia sẻ với các bạn nhé thì uh, làm dipping em nghĩ cũng rất là vui là tại vì uh, em nghĩ thứ nhất là mình không có uh, dùng liquid thì nó bớt mùi và với tiếp tiền thì nó 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 dùng cái, cái resin là glue là cái chất uh, nhựa thì nó 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 bám bột nó vô trên móng thì mình phải khắc phục làm sao mà làm cho nó vừa đẹp vừa thon và cho cái móng nó chuẩn thì hôm nay sẽ chỉ, chia sẻ về đó và hôm nay tất cả những sản phẩm em làm là cũng uh, nhờ công ty uh, uh, New Genesis thì em cũng rất là um, có giới thiệu các bạn qua những uh, sản phẩm của New Genesis thì em hôm nay em muốn chia sẻ thêm về cái này thì em có nhiều vài màu mà của công ty như Genesis em rất là thích thì hôm nay em sẽ chia sẻ nhé. Um, yeah, so um, hi John, how are you? <cười> Trước khi em bắt đầu thì em want to say hi to few friends. Um, em thấy Leah nè, thấy Clara, Pauline, hi, how are you? Uh, uh, Patrice, is that Patrice, how? Yeah. Uh, Patrice, okay. And China, how are you? And John, thank you and for the coffee. Like I said, we love it. And uh, and um, ông xã chị rất là thơm thích cái, cái coffee của em cho uh, tụi chị tại vì cái mùi rất là uh, thơm và uống chị thích uống uh, đắng với lại uống uh, uh, 
cà phê đen nhưng nhưng mà nếu mà bỏ thêm tí sữa thì cũng rất là ngon so I just want to say thank you so much em for the gift um, I think I'm gonna ask you for review soon but I will call you for order so thank you em so much uh, yeah so um, like I said I'm gonna share some dipping uh, powder techniques um, I know a lot of um, if, if you guys just starting to do dipping um, powder service you might be intimidated with long nail um, with dipping powder but I'm gonna assure you you can achieve the same uh, structurally sound look with long long nails with dipping powder as well so today I'm gonna do some tie-dye but I also give you some basics so I'm gonna do two nails one with just a basic how you uh, achieve that structure with the apex and also one fun nail with like tie-dye look because I feel like it's such a cute fun look and it's pretty easy as well so uh, let's get started okay guys um, yeah, so I like I have done uh, these two just to show you a little bit. Isn't that fun? Like you just pull out some color and just so then, you know, pull it together, sprinkle a little bit on top. It's kind of fun, right? So I used the, um, the taper square tip that I, um, that we have it on the website. So I pre, um, I prep everything like last uh, Tuesday, we shared with you how um, I did that already. If you guys need more help, please look for the last uh, live on Tuesday that we did. I really go in depth of how you can um, prep the nails, apply the tip, and how to prep the tip with the natural nail to make it blend, and um, so then your shape will be nice. So watch that. So um, with dipping, there's two few techniques that I find that you can um, uh, do, uh, like this one. I have done some kind of like I call it pre kind of pre prep I mean kind of pre pre shape the nails before I go in any color it's just like how you know you would do with clear foundation before you work uh, before you work on acrylic or anything like that so that's one way you can do it um, or you can go straight to um, you know prep apply a few layers and go straight to color, but I find that a lot of people are just starting out. Uh, you need that little extra help to have that even layer. So I did prep the nails, but I'm gonna show you how I achieve that, okay? So hôm nay em sẽ chia sẻ với các bạn cách làm sao build một cái móng dipping dài mà nó vẫn giữ cái móng chuẩn và đẹp ha. Thì uh, cái này là những cái kinh nghiệm mà em học được cũng uh, từ các bạn, nhất là những từ công ty New Genesis Educator. I feel like they're really good. So once, um, some of them share really unique uh, tips um, uh, while we were doing uh, videos for them. So I just thought I'd pass along the techniques and share that with you guys, okay? So đây là một cái móng em đã prep sơ sơ rồi ha. Tại vì em đã um, làm như vậy thì các bạn thấy đó on the side view là cái cái móng nó sẽ có chuẩn là tại vì mình build clear nhưng mà nó cũng có cái apex, độ apex, độ cao. Thì làm vậy thì cái móng nó rất là chuẩn và đẹp. Thì bây giờ em sẽ có... Uh, show cho các bạn làm sao mình làm như vậy rồi rồi làm xong rồi mình làm màu luôn thì nó rất là ra đẹp ha thì bây giờ em sẽ cái móng này là em mới chỉ gắn lên thôi em chưa có đắp cái gì hết thì bây giờ em sẽ chia sẻ cái 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 technique đó nha rồi so, bây giờ em sẽ dùng um, thì các bạn biết là cái mùa với cái mùa dịch này thì nhiều uh, tiểu ban hay là uh, nhiều chỗ nó không cho mình uh, đứt vô cái hũ uh, tuy rằng em biết nhiều người cũng đã quen rồi thì khó sửa cái cái habit của mình nhưng mà nếu mà các bạn được thì em em cũng khuyên các bạn nếu mà khách thường 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 nếu mà làm mà nó hơi không muốn nhúng vô uh, hũ này thì các bạn có thể đổ ra và vô mấy cái disposable tray này thì mình xài làm sao thì mình có thể dục uh, bình thường thì um, em thích đổ ra ha so today I'm gonna show you what color I'm using. Hôm nay sẽ dùng màu uh, uh, fresh start là cái màu rất là đẹp là cứ giống như màu blue vậy đó. Ha? Thì mình làm cái tie dye ha. Uh, Linda just tune in. Hi Linda. <cười> Thank you for tuning in. Uh, các bạn đang coi thì các bạn uh, share cái live dùng nhá. Vô những cái group để cho những các bạn mà đang um, chưa khắc phục được làm dipping thì đây là cũng một cách để mình học hỏi với nhau và tương tác với nhau nhá. So yeah, so and say you, uh, of course, you can never, just like dipping or any acrylic or gel, you always need clear, right? So you need a clear. And I'm gonna use this color Southern Belle, which is like a really nice pink. Uh, this is a really color, good color. It's called Mermaid, uh, number 91. So, rất là đẹp, các bạn? 
với lại cái màu yellow này gọi là sunflower so em sẽ dùng um, mấy cái màu này phối hợp với nhau để làm tie dye nhưng mà em cũng sẽ dùng một cái là gọi nó nó gọi là neutral light và để nó là giống như gần giống cái soft white vậy đó thì em sẽ dùng cái này để làm cái nền rồi sau đó em sẽ dùng mấy cái màu này bỏ lên để cho cái cái màu nó sáng và tươi hơn ha so I'm using this neutral light is like a soft white What I'm gonna do is use it as a base and then as I'm sprinkle some colors on, it will look really nice and enhance the color as well. So pretty much this is what I'm gonna use. So uh, let's see, before I'm using anything, I'm just gonna dispense that. While I'm doing that, you wanna say hi to anybody? Yes, yeah, so we're gonna give a couple shout outs on people on YouTube. All right, thank you guys for joining in. So we're gonna say hi to Laura. Hello, Laura. Um, Mighty Spouse, how you doing? Um, Anna Good, she says she's from East Coast, New Jersey. Thank you for staying up and tuning in. Um, and then we have Sandy Sanchez. Hello, Sandy. She says she's uh, from Florida. She says thank you. Um, Tara Bay. She said hello from Switzerland. Oh my gosh, we love having international people watch us. <laughs> Thanks for t tuning in. Um, we have Issa BB. Hello, she said love your show from Florida. Um, Andrea Lane. She said love watching new ways to build your nails. And then um, the the snooze button. She said good evening. So thank you guys for tuning in and joining in. Um, if you guys um, are new and you guys are just tuning in, we are going over. Um, how to recreate kind of like a tie-dye inspired look using dip powder and um, if you guys want to make sure that you don't miss out or you want to rewatch it uh, make sure to share this to your Facebook page so that you don't lose it or if you're on YouTube just save it or like like our video so that you can go back to your, and watch your liked videos too so yes okay so can I and you um, so let me do the Let me see, let me put this aside before we get really in depth of what it is. So, and say, and say, làm một cái basic trước để cho show you guys how to làm cái, um, cái build cái apex trước ha. Thì em đối với em cái, cái tip này em thấy là nhà làm nó, nó gọn nhất mà nó cũng nhanh nhất nữa. Tuy rằng là mình có thể uh, bỏ tí thì giờ mình shape before mình bỏ color nhưng mà em thấy cái 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 cách nó uh, làm cũng rất là hiệu quả. So before I do anything, I'm just gonna put the number one which is like a nail prep thì em sẽ bỏ lên cái cái natural nail chưa ha hi yan vicky hi yến em how are you <laughs> thank you for tuning in so em sẽ bỏ cái prep just là number one ok so then uh, course mình làm dip mình phải uh, base gel là number two ha thì trước khi bắt đầu thì em sẽ làm một cái um, um, uh, natural base cái này là natural base là giống như là cái um, Uh, not used to build the foundation đó. Mỗi công ty nó có cái loại uh, and, um, Either clear uh, With new genesis Các bạn có thể dùng clear Hoặc dùng natural base để mình build cái foundation Thì cái nào xài cũng được uh, Các bạn nên dùng những cái clear as, clear as possible Tại những cái clear nó không có pigment So, so, so nó sẽ build cái móng mình nó chắc và bền hơn Ok So bây giờ em sẽ dùng cái uh, cái cái base uh, cái base này natural base này để mình làm uh, build cái foundation ha. Huh? So I always want to use the natural base or as clear to build the foundation of the nail. So you want to use the clear nail as possible so then you you want to avoid any pigment into the clear powder because that way it gives you a, a nice sturdy foundation. Okay, so first off, let me just how I build this. So first off, you always want to build where the area you uh, blend the powder, okay? So you just, you can dip that or actually, uh, and then the second coat, once you build that, that's just like a bridge. So mình làm những cái cầu vậy đó, tại từ lúc ngón thiệp với cái ngón dạ, ngón thiệp với cái móng giả dạ, thì nó sẽ có cái 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 lõm mà đó ha. So bây giờ em sẽ mình làm gì mình cho nó cái cái móng đó cho nó cho nó dày lên chút xíu ha. So bây giờ em sẽ làm một mình đi khoảng chừng 70% cái móng ha. So I'm building about 70% of the nail and you want to build like a thin even coat. Okay guys, you want a thin even coat. And then cái này clear thôi base huh? and then that's it 
and I'm gonna as you can see right there it's already like you're building the apex right you can see the apex already right so because this is a long nail I'm gonna put another coat before um, I move on so I'm gonna build another coat so I'm gonna go about 80% this time so bây giờ em sẽ build là một lớp mỏng nữa khoảng chừng đi 80% ha so mỗi lần mình đi thêm một lớp là mỗi lần mình làm lên thêm chút xíu so mình từ 60, 70 bây giờ mình lên 80 ha mà các bạn phải làm cho sao cho nó mỏng nha so mình có thể giúp lên vậy ha so yeah so như vậy bây giờ các bạn coi cái apex mình có nè nó đi rất là đều đúng không đấy so các bạn đi vậy xong rồi ha bây giờ một nếu mà các bạn thấy các bạn đi đều hết rồi đó thì các bạn có thể đi thẳng vô màu nhưng em có một cách nữa nếu mà các bạn thấy mà cái 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 cái, cái này mình làm chưa chuẩn á thì các bạn có thể bỏ activator rồi mình shape chút xíu trước khi mình làm màu so right now if you look at this nail I have achieved it pretty nice and even coat I really do not have any problem of moving on but let's just say while you're doing this you have such a long nail and you don't have enough um, you know like you the, the nail is pretty like um, not even or the apex is not there what you could do to I have another tip that I want you guys to follow is that active nail activate it mình muốn activate nó cho nó cứng ha tại thường thường á mình làm long nail á mình mình mặc uh, bỏ nhiều lớp quá mà mình không có activate nó á, thì nó sẽ bị uh, dễ bị gãy vì cần nó không có đủ um, cái activate với cái chia nó chưa có um, uh, giống như nó, nó chính chung với nhau á thì đây là cũng một cách để cho các bạn khắc phục nó là mình có thể activate nó sơ sơ rồi đợi khoảng chừng vài phút ha đợi dùng ngoài dài 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 phút xong bắt đầu mình shape nó so, làm như vậy á các bạn lúc mà bỏ màu á thì cái màu nó sẽ lên rất là mướt và rất là đẹp ha đây là cái một uh, cách em làm để cho nó khắc phục cái cái um, cái, um, cái tiếp mà để cho cái shape nó chuẩn nhất là cái bóng dài á thì em thấy mình dip á thì nó hơi 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 khó khăn chút xíu là tại vì móng càng dài mình phải dip làm sao cho nó càng chuẩn cho nó ra cái shape mình muốn cái cách này đối với em thì em thấy em rất là thích là tại vì nhiều người giống như đắp chuộn rồi đó thì không mất cần làm như vậy nhưng mà nếu mà em chỉ muốn chia sẻ nếu mà các bạn chưa có khắc phục được đó, thì các bạn có thể dùng cái cách này để làm cho mình à, các bạn không cần làm móng dài giống em đâu nhưng mà tại vì hôm nay em chia sẻ thì mình muốn làm cho nó dài dài chút xíu cho nó đẹp thì bây giờ em sẽ dũ sơ sơ để cho các bạn thấy là mình có thể dũ uh, sơ sơ lại cho nó mịn lại hoặc là cho cái shape nó 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 thon lại chút xíu tại các bạn cũng biết mình làm dipping á lúc mà cái mình dip xong cái cái bột nó sẽ nở ra và nó dày ra nó bè ra nữa thì cách này cũng có thể là một cách để cho mình làm cho cái 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 bột nó thon lại chút xíu before mình move on ha huh. so as you can see if I activate the the few layers that I apply it gives you a chance to activate the powder because with a, such a long nail you gotta do multiple layers you in average you probably need four three to four layer of color and maybe three to four layer of clear like this so in order to um, for the product to heal well without cracking you want to activate the product so this is a way to kind of activate the product and kind of like a middle halfway done and if it, it's also a way for you to shape the nail before you move on to the color Mm -hmm. Hi Tina, how are you? Oh, hi Raymond. Wow, hôm nay Raymond tune in. Đừng có cười em nha, làm chị em rung quá nè. <cười> I learned a lot from you Raymond, thank you for tuning in. So, đây là một cách là em cũng uh, nhiều, có mấy lần Raymond với lại uh, Kim Oan, tổng uh, New Genesis Educator, đây cũng chia sẻ nhiều cái tip với em, em cũng học hỏi rất là nhiều. Thì hôm nay, em, like I said, em cũng pass along những cái tip này để cho các bạn khắc phục được làm dipping. Tại em biết uh, dipping cũng là một cái service rất là chuẩn trên ở trong những cái salon ha, uh, vài, uh, vài, năm, vài năm gần đây. Thì đây là cũng một cách để mình cùng nhau học hỏi và chia sẻ nhé. Thì bây giờ em shape sơ sơ, thật ra nếu mà các bạn không biết, à, không muốn dùng bằng uh, 
à, tay thì có thể mình dùng cái sandy band nhé thì bây giờ em sẽ lightly buff cái 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 nail này nhé so bây giờ em sẽ I'm just lightly buff the nail and make everything nice and smooth so you can see even the just the nail by itself it gives a lot a little bit of um, uh, kind of like a foundation already so right now I'm just kind of lightly buff the nail just so everything is nice and contour and just kind of refine the surface a little bit so then later when you do dipping it's nice and even you can see I don't file a lot of powder off I'm not trying to file everything off I'm just kind of refining it so then later as I'm doing it I don't have a lot of um, shaping to do with the color so đây là một cách em dũ sơ sơ ha để cho cái 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 móng nó trộn lại và cho nó uh, uh, cho nó mịn lại mịn là không phải là mịn cho lắm mà cho nó móng cho nó chuẩn lại ha thì giống như cái này em cũng làm rồi bây giờ em chỉ dũ sơ sơ lại thôi nhé you have any questions uh, we have uh, dark woman on youtube joined us she said hi morning i miss your wonderful work mm. she said hi and oh hi thank you for tuning in <laughs> So I know this today I'm slightly do something different, but because I feel like dipping is such a popular service, and so a lot of people have hard time building the apex with dipping powder. So if you guys are uh, learning how to do dipping powder, or just kind of interested of you know putting this service out in your salon, this is a good way to learn how to kind of like do take care of the structure of a nail with dipping because I I know with dipping you can put you know a couple beads and you can build the structure right away but dipping you cannot do one layer at a time just so then you can build that apex okay Sharon hi Sharon how are you <laughs> but she's saying I'm trying to do two things at once what are you doing two things at once Sharon <laughs> so they love my đó em dũa sơ sơ thì các bạn sẽ thấy đó cái móng rất là chuẩn ha, so nó cũng không có bè ra nhiều, tại vì mình làm mình dũa sơ sơ rồi, ha, so đây là mình dũa cái kiểu này á thì cái móng nó không có bè, thì nếu mình làm cho nó chuẩn ha, thì mình cứ take time em thì vừa nói chuyện vừa chia sẻ với các bạn thì mình làm chậm chậm chút xíu và thật ra em thấy nhiều người professional làm ở một bụi full set um, rất là dài mà làm cũng khoảng chừng không qua một tiếng là xong thì rất là hay nên em cũng muốn thấy làm vậy thì nhiều um, cái technique rất là um, bổ ích cho các bạn thì em cũng muốn chia sẻ nhé. So bây giờ em sẽ phổi uh, bụi nhé. Trước khi mình làm thì mình phổi bụi cho nó sạch nhé. So các bạn thấy đó nếu mình làm gì thì cái móng nó sẽ chuẩn hơn đúng không? Cái effect nó đẹp hơn đúng không? Thì đó. Với lại cái cách mình làm thì cho nó ngắn gọn tôi làm mình biết em biết làm cái này thì extra step nhưng mà thực ra at the end result thì nó nó hay hơn ha so this I know a little bit off but I feel like if you prep it well like this the shape is gonna be nice as well so let's just start with one color ha bây giờ hôm nay em sẽ chia sẻ với các bạn cái màu nút này cái màu nút này là cái màu nơ mới của uh, của New Genesis để em chia sẻ cái New Genesis thì có cái uh, 12 màu nút collection mà hôm nay em sẽ dùng cái màu em là cái màu này nhé. So bây giờ em sẽ chia sẻ cái màu này mà các bạn thấy đó mấy cái màu collection này rất là đẹp. Thì em cũng có feature cái cái dài màu rồi thì bây giờ em sẽ làm nhé. So bây giờ em sẽ Nếu mà các bạn làm thì các bạn đổ ra. Nếu mà cái này thì dip lên móng dài thì hơi khó thì that's why em sẽ uh, try to wrap nó lên thì cho nó tiện hơn ha. So let me try to do that. I try to cover that up so nó không có bay tùm lum hết ha. So bây giờ em sẽ làm base number 2 nha, trở lại base number 2 nhé. So em sẽ đi lại cái So lúc nào mình cũng cần có một cái thịt container vậy ha. So bây giờ Bây giờ lấy base number 2 nha các bạn. So ok, bây giờ mình bắt đầu đi lên nhích chút xíu ha. Mình hồi lấy mình lên 80, bây giờ mình lên khoảng chừng 85% cũng được hay là chín chục nhé. So bây giờ mình lên cho nó đều nha các bạn. Mình lên vừa lấy mướt, vừa lấy nước cho đủ mỏng và đẹp nhé, mỏng và đều nhé các bạn. So I'm just gonna sprinkle. Nhớ nút nút always xoay cái móng cho nó bên hông luôn nhé. 
Turn the gun. So just make sure you have everything. Nhớ first layer ha. Xong mình lắc nó. Xong mình phổi bụi nó nha. Xong để cho các bạn thấy là nó ra rất là đẹp. Do you guys like it so far? Hử? Huh? Thấy không? Cái này nè, đối với em thấy thì nó rất là tiện là tại vì bây giờ các bạn có thể từ từ build cái apex lên ha. So thường thường màu á, nếu mà móng dài như vậy á, em thấy là mình phải dip uh, từ 3 tới 4 lần. Thì tùy theo mình làm nhé. Bây giờ em sẽ đi một lớp cho nó dày hơn ha. Uh, lên lên cao chút xíu, I'm sorry. Nó vào cũng dày hơn nhé. Mình đi từ từ cho nó sơn vừa vừa mỏng và vừa đều nhé. Vừa mỏng và vừa đều. That's the key cho dipping ha. Rồi bây giờ mình bụi lên tiếp. I don't know about you, but I love that sprinkling. <laughs> so satisfying to watch. So then you can see, yeah, that's another layer. But you can see each time I do it, look at the apex and the structure of the nail. It looks really good, right? I don't know if you like it so far, but kind of enjoying it, right? So bây giờ em sẽ làm thêm một lớp nữa nhé. So like I said, cái móng này nó dài thì mình phải làm từ từ ha, từ từ bước lên nữa nhé. So cái móng này lớp, hồi lấy là cái hai lớp rồi, bây giờ cái móng lớp thứ ba nhé. So bây giờ mình lên gần khoảng chừng 95% ha. So mình làm cho nó đều nhé. So bây giờ em sẽ đổ ra nhé. So bây giờ nhé. I don't know you guys love that, but I don't know why, but I love that. So mình tại thường thường làm á mình phải phủ như vậy cũng được cho nó hay hơn nhưng mà tại móng tại em dài quá em không có phủ được. So you can see bây giờ cái apex nó cao lên là phải không? Và cái mặt nó mịn phải không? Và cái shape nó không đến nổi rồi. Right? right? You can see it. I'm gonna stop. You can see it. The building the apex. So that's a good way to build the apex. I don't know if you can like techniques, this techniques or not, but in a way, I feel like this is very um, easy for me when I do a long nail. What do you guys think so far? This looks so great. Honestly, it doesn't even look thick at all. I feel like that's the issue with dip if you, like, I, I don't know. I actually went one. This is like, I went to a salon once, one time, and this I, I paid for a service one time, and you guys are like, what the heck, why would you go to a salon? Your mom does nails. Well, I was really desperate and I really wanted to get my nails done. And so I was like, oh, I'll just like go to a salon nearby me when I was in school. I'll get my nails done. I'll do dip. You know, it can't be that bad. You guys, it was so bad. It was like chunky and it was uneven and it was not it. It was not it. So lesson learned, never go back to a salon. My mom is the only person who will do my nails for me from now on. Forever, forever, okay? <laughs> <laughs> so right now, yeah, same thing. This is the fourth layer. And I'm just gonna sprinkle that on top. And make sure you do the side and the other side. Okay, and voila. So yeah, now you can look at this and decide for yourself. If you feel like you need, um, if you see the thickness, if it's even or not, but you can see the apex is there and the shape is really nice. Yeah, and it doesn't look bulky, it doesn't look uneven. This is like really, really pretty. So, also, the color's really nice too. Yeah. So I find that it looks pretty good. If you feel like you don't have enough the apex, you can always dip it with clear so then you can build the apex again. But if you like it like that, then you can stop. But let me see, hold on, let me look at the side view. Looks good like that? Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm gonna stop right there. And so I can put the activator on. Do you guys like this so far? But you can see, I just wanna show you with the, you know, with dipping, um, it doesn't matter what you do, you could always, you know, build the, uh, the apex and the structure of nail. It never changed just because you change your medium, okay? The structure of the nail should always be the same. And the key here, when you put uh, activator, make sure you put enough. 
but not overdo it as well because that's kind of uh, that's why you can create a lot of um, um, cracking if you even if you put too much of the um, activator too okay so just make sure you have enough around the cuticle area on the body and that's it and let it dry so let me show you how I achieve this look, okay? So now this is the kind of tie-dye look, right? So then I'm gonna do this. So I think this is one of the uh, design that I find is really fun. I mean, I can share more design with dipping if you guys um, really like this type of techniques and a uh, service you want me to share more, I'm more than happy to. But for today, I think the tie-dye look is what always in. So I'm gonna show you that, okay? All right, so let's move on. So now I'm gonna get, um, uh, what you call it? I'm gonna do. Gonna show you this color, neutral light. So neutral light is like a soft white. Cái màu neutral light là giống như cái màu uh, soft white ha. Thì bây giờ em muốn làm cái tie dye mấy cái màu này nó muốn cho nó nổi lên á, thì em sẽ uh, bỏ một hai lớp lên để cho các bạn thấy là mình có thể từ từ build lên ha. Uh, Darkness mm -hmm. woman on YouTube said, "Lucky you are. You have a great mom." <laughs> Yes, I always have the blingiest of blingiest nails whenever I went to a school dance when I was in high school. Uh, Linda said, love it. Uh, China said, looking good. Thank you, China. Clara put a thumb up. Thank you, you guys, for your love and support. Uh, I think I just saw Stella tune in. Tanya, uh, Tang, huh? how, how are you? Thank you for tuning in. So, bây giờ, em sẽ làm một lớp. Cái này là gọi là, what's it called? Neutral light. You have to keep track of the name. Okay, I'm so bad with names. So bây giờ em sẽ làm một lớp nhé, cho nó rất là mình muốn làm cho nó mỏng và đều, mà cũng đừng quên đi mấy cái trong góc này nha các bạn. Mình phải đi trong góc nhé, để cho nó đều nhé. So make sure you get even on the side wall as well, and make sure you have thin and even coverage. Okay guys, that's the key here is the uh, when you do the number two, you know that's very important because that's where you get all the Turn it this way, so then, see? And then, I like about this disposable tray is that you can always pull it back. If, let's like just say you use, you know, not enough, then you can always pull it back, so then you just use it, and after that, you can dispose it, so your client will really happy. But you can see there, it looks fairly good, right? So I'm gonna do another coat. I really, I feel like this is like, you make it seem so easy. Well, it's just because with, with I find that um, with powder, like you do a monomer powder, you can do one, two bead, and you control where you uh, feather that product and how you kind of pull everything in the center and build the apex. But with uh, dipping powder, I find that it's slightly harder. So you have to build one layer at a time. And this is a, way, a, a great way of doing it. Yeah. I wonder, are, for our viewers, um, are you guys typically doing like dip or are you doing like more gel? I wonder, I know acrylics, um, I feel like that's like a, like I feel like a lot of people do or they just don't do it at all. But do you guys typically do more dip or do you think you guys do more gel? Because I feel like gel has also has been like been a really staple. I feel like people don't use, do people even use nail polish anymore? Yeah, but I feel like gel polish no. is more. But for toes, I st I still favor polish because I don't like to take gel polish off from the toes. Yeah, true. <laughs> <laughs> so now I'm just gonna go another coat because I know my apex is not done yet. So I'm just gonna go another coat right here. And again, you want a nice even coat, okay? And now I'm gonna go one one hundred percent. Again, you want to go close to the cuticle area as possible and on the side as well, okay? You, if you feel like you're having too much on, you can always clean your brush and go back and feather everything down. Nice and smooth, okay? And then I'm just gonna pour that in. Okay? Yeah, look, look at the side view. But you guys, <laughs> I just love that side view. I don't know why. <laughs> what I do now, my favorite view is the side view. I feel once I have my apex, I'm so happy. 
<laughs> do, do you guys do that too? I feel like it's so much fun. Okay, now guys, let's do the tie-dye look, okay? So it's really fun here. I'm just gonna, there's a couple ways to do it too. Tie-dye, I feel like you can um, tap it with the color. Okay, let's, let's me do it, okay. I'm First of all, I just want to say, I love these colors. I love, tie-dye is like so in now. Mm -hmm. I don't know if you guys are on TikTok, all right? But TikTok is blowing up the whole tie-dye thing and they're bringing it back. Like we tried, we wanted to do a family activity where we were going to tie-dye t-shirts together and we literally couldn't because all the tie-dye kits are sold out online. Even we tried going to like two different, two, two, two like three different stores, couldn't find them. And all we have are t-shirts. That's it. We don't even have the tie-dye. We just bought the t-shirts. We don't even have tie-dye yet. So I love that the tie-dye trend is coming back in. And these colors are so cute. Look okay. It. So now I have this. I'm just going to go one more layer. Okay, guys. I'm going to go from the cuticle. Again, same thing. You want to do it from top to bottom with nice, thin, even coat. And make sure you cover the cuticle as well. Okay. I'm just gonna add a little bit more, just so then I have a nice cuticle area. And now I'm gonna clean my brush and then kind of like swipe it nice and even and make sure I get all the area, okay? And I love about this base too, it doesn't dry that quickly, but it doesn't take that long to dry to begin with. So I'm gonna take the, the yellow and I just take the brush and then just kind of sprinkle that on. Okay, I clean my brush and I'm gonna do another color. You just kind of like, the tie-dye look, there's no, can you turn that a little bit? Okay, I just keep doing that and I'm just gonna see if I can get the blue. Yeah, we're moving quick here, you guys. Yeah, because the heat guys remember with the heat we have to move it quickly so I have to do it quickly this is not fun when you do uh, dipping in the heat too that's nothing it's just like a monomer it does affect the weight it, because the heat it dries everything quicker so you can see there look okay and then I have a little bit more on this side that I feel like I can add in there I can always So it's just kind of fun like this. Just kind of do it until you feel like, okay, you have enough, a little bit of it, and then let it, and just kind of feather that down. But you see how much fun that is. How'd you like it? So obviously the first coat is not, um, uh, it's not really like uh, show enough color, so you have to do another coat, okay? But by just bring it on, you can tell that the shape it doesn't really change much. So now I'm gonna do another one. Claire, what did Claire say? Well, Sharon said her the side view and the um, the apex is my favorite. I missed how you did that dip with dipping powder. I'm so impressed. And <laughs> then you. Claire said, I have a little bit of everything. Most of my clients prefer dip over gel because it lasts longer on them. Mm -hmm. I still use gel on natural nails as well as acrylic. I have acrylic clients that have switched over to dip and love how it feels. Mm. Mm. Nice. Yeah. I have two tan tune in tan carrot. That's the the, the, the name and tan bo. So thank you các bạn tune in in nhé. Và các bạn đang coi thì share cái like này dùm em luôn nhé. So bây giờ cái màu nó cũng đẹp rồi nhưng mà em sẽ làm thêm một lớp nữa nha. Em sẽ làm thêm một lớp nữa để cho uh, cho nó đều lại ha. So let me see the yellow. Okay. So now I'm using the base number two again. Okay. And then I'm gonna apply another layer of this base number two. With long nails, it's hard to do one short um, application. So just try to kind of constantly brushing down the nail and make sure you have thin and even coat. Lúc nào các bạn làm dipping nhớ các bạn phải có cho nó đều và mỏng thôi nhé, đừng có dày quá. Nếu mà các bạn lỡ mà có làm dày quá thì các bạn có thể uh, quét cái 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 cỏ và cho nó mọng lại nhé. Cho nó mọng lại. Ok. So yeah. 
Johanna on YouTube. She said, beautiful colors. Yeah, I love this. I find it. It's really cute. And then Tina Lamb, she said, yes, looks fun and pretty. Yeah, I love this yellow and I feel like this. I don't know why since Tiffany loved yellow, I, I've been incorporating a lot of yellow, yellow for her. But I feel like she really enjoyed it. So kind of nice. I really like yellow, but honestly, all these colors are really pretty and they're very pigmented. So it really, like when you put them into this design together, it really pulls out the complements of each other. Mm -hmm. Well, the tie dye that's what it's all about, is right. So. Yeah, tie dye is too. I feel like tie, I love the thing about tie dye. It could be two colors, and it could be like ten colors. Like it still looks good no matter how many colors you add. And it could be like literally the most bizarre colors, like bizarre colors put together. But honestly, it always just kind of looks like a really pretty mess. <laughs> yeah. So yeah. So see, now the color is slightly more pigmented and you can see it looks pretty cool. So I'm going to clean everything the way before I dust everything. It does get a little messy, guys, when you work with dipping powder, I'm not going to lie. But well, you know, that's why it's so much fun, right? So. Voila! I know I got little dust in there, right? Oops, I touch it. I accidentally touch it. Okay, so what you guys think so far? Okay, so now let's just say if you feel like you have enough thickness, which I do, but if you feel like you um, wanna do another coat, that's fine too. But I think the apex look pretty good, right, honey? Huh? Does it look good? Do you guys like this so far? You know? Mm -hmm. Ayana said, and um, the fact that it goes with everything, see? Mm -hmm. Colors, the colors, they kind of go with everything. Okay. Yeah, I think I accidentally touched this area, so I'm just going to put another coat right there. I think, yeah. You know what? I, I accidentally touched it, so I have to go back and put another coat right there, guys. Because if you don't activate it, the powder is slightly... Um, it, uh, it's not gonna dry, so I'm just gonna feather some color on the side here, just so then I have everything. Clara said, if you're not covered in glitter and powder, then it's not a good day. <laughs> <laughs> true, so true. Yeah, you're talking like a true artist. <laughs> So I'm, I'm just adding a little bit more pigment because I noticed um, I touched in certain area. So now I have to kind of like, uh, I accidentally touch it on the side and it's not smooth. So I'm just gonna add a little bit on and then I could just kind of help me shape that up later. And the rest of it, if you want, I'm just gonna put a little bit of clear here just so then the color is Okay, that way, see now that you use the tray, it doesn't matter what color you blend, it doesn't, you know, contaminate other colors. So that's another good way of doing it. Yeah, do you guys like it so far? See? It's kind of, can be fun, right, you guys? Yeah, Darkness Woman said, no need to fail, you make it really fun and easy. <laughs> Thank you. Well, this is why I love it because, you know, I, you know, it's, we all about sharing and learning from each other. So, you know, I feel like I got opportunity to work with uh, these amazing companies. So I learned a lot from the educators and from the company because there's certain standard they want to keep. So as I'm learning it, I want to pass along to you guys. So hope, hope you guys like, you know, what we've been sharing. And as long as you guys love to watch this, then I'm, we're going to continue doing it. But I feel like if you guys stop watching, then you guys don't want to watch it, so we'll stop too because there's no point of doing it and no one watching it. So keep coming every week, guys. Uh, Tammy, thank you for tuning in. And Pauline said, I love it. Thank you so much. So now, okay, I'm done. I'm pretty much done. So now, um, I usually, when I work with a lot of color, I try not to cap it with clear. It just, um, you know, it's just the way that um, I feel like once you establish the shape while you uh, working, there's no need to put clear anyways because you just really need bare minimum of shaping. So yeah, okay. 
Clara said, I need to see the names of those colors again so I can get them. Oh, yeah, sure. Let me, let me show them. Uh, let's see. Sunflowers is the yellow one. Uh, mermaid is the, the green one. So let me show you. The mermaid is this green. Sunflower is the, the yellow. Yeah. Mm -hmm. The pink is Southern Bell. And Fresh Start is the blue. So I hope you guys can see this. And I also use clear and... Um, a natural base for the foundation of the nails mm -hmm. and Emma is one of the one of the nude color from their collection and this is the nude color okay so this is uh, yeah but they do have really beautiful a set of nude collection guys if you go want to check that out I feel like it's really you have a little bit of two that slightly shimmer but the rest is just like um, uh, just like color so Misha and Olivia it has a slightly shimmer to it. Okay? So yeah. Um, yeah, if you like New Genesis, go out there near um, go to your near supplier and support them because I find that they really um, really did a good job of providing especially base number two. I feel like it doesn't dry quickly uh, in a bottle, especially you know, you use it over and over again. I feel like it stays um, it doesn't dry it up quickly, which I like. Yeah, so I'm gonna dispose this later, because as you can tell, yeah, you can like the color. Yeah, everyone's loving it. Baby Cakes said, I love the colors. Ayana said, it's really earthy. I love them. Um, Darkest Woman said, thank you so much for sharing beautiful work and really beautiful colors. Going to use dip powder. Yeah, so now once you get that and you just tap on it, obviously this one dry already, but for you to test it just by clicking on it if you feel like you hear really like a clear clicking sound that means it's pretty set okay because sometimes you don't want to um, shape it when it's not uh, really dry yet okay so yeah I'm just gonna shape it and you know you shape it like you would with um, any you know any medium you just want to do slowly make sure you have all the sidewall straight and then you know the free edge straight out like I said, you notice the, the nail does expand out a little bit because dipping, once it's dry and set, it does expand a little bit. So I such, another tip I want to give you too is taper your tip slightly thinner because once the product expands, then you don't take a lot of time kind of taping, uh, tapering your shape. So look, các bạn làm dipping, các bạn muốn, uh, các bạn nên shape cái móng thon vô chút xíu tại vì lúc mà cái cái bột nó có nở ra thì nó không có làm cho cái cái móng của mình nó bè quá ha à, thì cả, đây là cũng một cái ý kiến mà anh muốn nhắc cho các bạn ha thì đó các bạn có you can like it các bạn có thích không thì đối với em em không biết các bạn có thích dipping không thì nếu mà các bạn thích những cái video này nữa thì cho em biết nhá make sure let me know then maybe I can do some more dipping design you know but I find that with this simple technique, like I showed you guys earlier, that's a pretty good technique. I feel like when I do a long nail, I tend to do that. So it's just really easy to to achieve that apex. And you know, that apex is, is like a key. It's key to have, you know, longevity on, um, on your nails, right? On your clients, especially. So now I'm just contour a little bit. Uh-huh. Maggie Spouse asked, will these also work as acrylic powder? Uh, I, I personally have not tried it like with monomer, but I know I have seen other uh, nail tech or nail artists, they have used it as um, with monomer as well. So I guess um, you can. Uh, I don't know, I haven't tried it yet, but maybe I'll try it and I'll let you know, okay? Uh, personally, I haven't tried it yet. Like I said, I have seen a few other people did and uh, they they find I, I they look really good so i guess you can uh jin hun said i love it oh thank you <laughs> yeah the shape là móng uh, dài với dipping thì hơi uh, khó khắc phục chút xíu nhưng mà các bạn cũng thấy là mình có thể làm ha làm như vậy thì vừa làm gì chậm chậm mình mới đầu thì mình làm hơi chậm thôi nhưng mà em nghĩ từ từ sẽ nó cũng ra rất là đẹp và mình làm một cái bộ dip mà đẹp rồi đó dài vậy á mình lấy mình lấy cái là mình chót được nhiều tại vì thật ra nó cũng đâu có mỏng hơn hay là yếu hơn bột đâu tại vì mình chưa có dip uh, chuẩn nữa thì nhiều người nghĩ là nó không có được um, đẹp thôi chứ thật ra làm từ từ giống như vậy thì em nghĩ cũng được mà 
từ từ đó số em muốn chia sẻ với các bạn những cái cái tip này để cho các bạn có thể từ từ người tập giờ nếu mà các bạn có làm dip rồi mà chưa làm móng dài thì đây là cũng có một cái cơ hội để cho các bạn thử nhé nếu mà các bạn thử thì cho em biết nhé see if the tip works for you or not let me know too so basically I'm just doing slowly oh hi Tân uh, Tân the man tune in anh <laughs> Tân say hi Tân <laughs> And uh, Yuen, uh, hi Yuen, how are you? Thank you for tuning in, nhé. Trời ơi, lâu quá không biết tân này làm gì mà bay vô đây vậy trời. <laughs> yeah. And Tân, can you you want to share about your show? I really want people to tune in and your weekly show with Jade. That's so cool. You can share that, please. Yeah, cho các bạn, các bạn nào mà tiếng gì mà muốn vô cái cái show của anh, của anh Tân Nguyễn đó. Um, so, mỗi tuần thứ hai phòng Tân. Okay, uh, can you put the link down so people can tune in? <laughs> yeah, so uh, đây là cũng một cách em làm dipping ha. So bây giờ em chỉ dùa sơ sơ. Các bạn thấy đó, em try not to dùa too much because you don't want to lose the shape. But as I'm doing it, I try to do it slowly so then um, mình không có mất cái 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 mỏng cái mỏng cái 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 bột nhé. So bây giờ em sẽ dùng cái uh, fine color, color by bit thôi Tại vì làm dipping thì các bạn cũng biết mình không có bột nhiều Nhất là mình đắp vừa đúng cái chuẩn của nó rồi thì mình không có cần đắp nhiều Thì bây giờ em sẽ dùng cái 3 in 1 color by bit nhé Thì bây giờ em sẽ lấy cái, lấy cái color bit này Color by bit này em sẽ đi dòng dòng với cuticle ha cho nó sạch lại thôi Tại thật ra cái móng nó cũng đều chuẩn hết rồi Mình cũng không có cần đi nhiều cho lắm ha thì các bạn thấy đó nó không có cần phải cầu kỳ cho lắm mình dũ nó sơ sơ lại cho hai bên hông cho nó thon lại thôi tại vì mình em cũng nói rồi lúc mà mình làm dip mình á cái bột nó sẽ nở ra chút xíu thì hai bên hông có thể mất nó bè ra thì bây giờ mình kéo cho nó thon lại thôi nha so on the I'm just taking the fine three in one cow by bit I'm basically just kind of tickling the surface without really put any pressure on while I'm filing because As you can see, the nail is slightly kind of flare out a little bit, like I said earlier. With dipping, once you cure everything, the, the powder does expand out a little bit. So you need to kind of like contour the shape a little bit more. So now, I'm just gonna... That's exactly what I'm doing. I'm just kind of contouring the shape. Yeah, and I'm gonna do the same thing with this side. Just a little bit of cuticle uh, refinement, not much because the shape is almost there. But you know, you do need a little work, so I'm just gonna lightly do the surface work. Because like I said, dipping is such a um, thin powder to begin with, and really there's no much of shaping you need to be, to be doing. So you just kind of lightly buff the surface. I'm just tickling the top, the surface anyway, so. Oh yeah, anybody? Yeah, if you guys are interested in buying bits, I know we had like a crazy deal um, on Tuesday that is ended, so we'll let you guys know about another deal that we have coming out. It is the 3 one bits. It's buy two, get one for one dollar. So I just want to give a couple shout outs to people who ordered um, and support us. Um, we have so many people that support us, but thank you. We just want to give a couple shout outs to people. So we just want to shout out to Delisa for ordering, um, Nancy Solaro, um, Talented Vixen and Tilliesh. They ordered um, Jacqueline and then Jang Lung. So thank you so much, um, you guys. If you guys are watching, thank you for supporting us. We literally cannot do this without you guys. So if you guys are um, want and to support. And Linda. Yeah, Linda came in and pretty much took a lot of stuff. <laughs> uh, <laughs> she hijacked my stuff. No, just kidding. Thank you, Linda and Anthony and Karen for being such a, a great supporter to us. Thank you, guys. Yeah, uh, we literally cannot do this without you guys. So if you guys um, want to support us in any way, please um, head over to our website at www.thenailtipshop.com. Um, again, the first deal that we're going to talk about today is the 3 one bits, and it's buy two, get one for one dollar. So just add three to your cart, and then the uh, last one will be one dollar. 
Oh, nice. I know, it's a good deal, right? It's a steal. Yeah. So right now I'm just gonna refine the, the free edge a little bit. Make sure everything nice and straight. But I hope you can like this look. And you know what? Don't think that dip with dipping, you can't put any design on. You can use a love butterfly sticker on top of this too, okay? If you guys want me to show you, I can also show you how you can uh, uh, apply the sticker on top of this to make it, um, or even um, foil. Actually, if you're gonna do the foil, any gel, don't activate, don't use the activator before you put on the uh, gel number four. But um, yeah, I, I don't, I know a lot of people think, oh, dipping, you can't not do a, too much design. Uh -uh. It just, it's just how you can put them together. I think, you know, that's a key too. But it can be fun, guys. Trust me. It's a lot of fun. I think dipping has come a long way. I feel like a lot of people are getting really creative of how they use their dipping powder to make into design. I feel like we very, um, as a Vietnamese artist, a lot of people are really good out there sharing techniques. So uh, we have to appreciate our industry and really support each other and, you know, watch each other's shows and live and share that, okay guys? I think there's a lot of good things going on, especially since pandemic. So kudos to all of us. Yeah. I feel like we really hit hard, especially in, in California. I don't know, you know, our governor's still making us working outside. And I personally can't work outside because the salon that I'm working at, um, we are unable to work outside because the way of the, the parking lot. But I know some, a uh, few of my friends um, are working and I feel the heat, man. The, lately, oh my God. It's, we, it's so like hot. Triple digit right now. No, we're like, I think I read something, I don't know if I mentioned this, but we're like in the middle of a heat dome right now. Like something, we're like where we live in SoCal, we're in the middle of a heat dome. So What's it's that been, mean? basically it's like air is being like, um, like rising from the earth and basically where we're at, it's created some sort of like, force where it's like the heat is trapped so that's why it's been so hot just in this past week yeah like it so literally hot. went from like it was it was really warm before but it's like really really hot now like our house is like burning when we come home because we're at the studio we come home i'm just like oh my god it's so hot so seriously to those who are making it work like all the applause for yeah, you okay exactly it's so tough to work out there. I mean, it's tough just to sit to receive the service, but to work and run around and yeah. try to do everything is like kudos to all of you. Seriously, it's amazing. All right, guys, so I'm pretty much done. And then I'm just gonna uh, clean her nails. Actually, you wanna go wash your hands. Wait, yeah, go wash your hands. Okay. And then just kind of quick rinse so then I can get all the um, stuff out. But while she's washing her hands, so nếu mà các bạn có muốn em làm sticker hay and on top, so then you can see how you hear the, the sticker on. But if you using, like just say you want to put design on for like gel art or lines and stuff like that, um, don't activate uh, before you put in number number four. Let me see. Because you know with dipping, you have to put the activator on, right? Before you put number four, because you, in order to, for this uh, kind of like a top coat to dry, you need the activator to accelerate, accelerate the drying, right? But if you do the gel or anything related to gel, then don't put the, uh, the activator, just go straight to the gel that you want to doing, that you are planning to do and put a top coat over it. But if you want to use the gel top coat, with the complete essential line from New Genesis, then you need to do the number three. So that's another tip if you guys are doing a lot of like gel art, you can still do it, okay? Nếu mà các bạn có làm gel art, hay là muốn bỏ gel, hay là những cái, uh, những cái gì mà có gel á, thì các bạn đừng có bỏ số 3 và đừng có dùng số 4. Còn nếu mà các bạn bỏ sticker á, so this is a chance for you to put the sticker. Let's just say if you gonna put the sticker or anything like that, Put the sticker on. Mm -hmm. Put the sticker on, and then put number three on top of the sticker, and then number four. Let me show you, for instance. Let me. This is just a quick one, okay, guys. Um, làm em muốn tại em biết bây giờ nhiều cái giống như on website mình cũng có nhiều cái sticker nhưng mà các bạn muốn làm sticker cho nó nhanh mà gọn á, mình có nhiều cái design như vậy á, thì mình có thể. Um, 
uh, làm cái sticker ha thì uh, giống như bây giờ có này đi let's just say uh, eye of the beholder said it's like your city's under a magnifying glass making it so much harder that's exactly what it feels like guys. oh yeah it's like i don't know what happened mm -hmm. just so i think through the fires i think that's partially part of it mm -hmm. but it's it's so hot here in SoCal. <laughs> i'm like oh my goodness i know Ok, so bây giờ nếu mà các bạn muốn bỏ sticker thì hoặc là giống như em nói nếu mà bỏ sticker mình mình muốn vẫn muốn dùng cái number 3, number 4 thì các bạn nên bỏ any sticker on, any design on first Ok, so let's just say cái uh, món này thì you have to put everything together but let's just say you do this, right? Sticker on Cái này là cũng là trong cái uh, website có nha Nhưng mà em nói thí dụ thôi Còn cái này là I, I kind of want to leave the, the design, but let's just say, just for fun, let's just put it separate out. Let's just, you don't have to do everything close to each other. So, so put a sticker on, huh? Okay, yeah, sticker on, like this, and then you can put activate. I hope this work. Okay, activator, and you can put the activator on top of the sticker as well, because that will help the sticker, uh, help the gel. So you put number three. Wap after you wash your hand. Go put number three. Sau khi oh, cái này let me. I think cái này tại hôm đấy nè. Yes. Rough to see. This I don't think I buff. I forgot to buff the nail earlier, you guys. Yeah. This okay. this sticker is like it's normally very sticky. This one is also coming in a set of 13 pieces. So if you guys are looking to get some stickers today, today because we also have another deal, you guys. Um, stickers is um, buy three get one free, which. We had this deal two weeks ago and you guys were going crazy. So we're bringing back for a very short amount of time, okay? And um, it's going to expire very soon. So make sure you head over to our website. Uh, we have everything, you guys. Flowers, luxury brand, butterflies, um, letters, flames. We have it all. So make sure to head over to our website because you're going to want new stickers. And this is a great deal. You just buy three and you get one free. And just gotta add all four to the cart, you guys, and okay. super easy. So now, once you do that, you have to wipe that dry a little bit. Mình muốn cho cái số bốn nó khô, mà nó không có hư cái cọ cái số bốn của mình thì các bạn phải chùi nhá. Các bạn phải chùi cái 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 activator nhá. Cái chùi cho nó khô nhá. So you want to wipe the activator slightly dry before you put on number four. Otherwise, uh, your brush gonna get um, hardened. So các bạn phải làm cho nó khô chút xíu ha. So bắt đầu các bạn mới bỏ lên nhé. So now I'm gonna do that. Delisa But... said I fell asleep during the DNC. Oh. Girl, you missed it. We gave you a shout out. Here's your other shout out. Thanks for supporting us. Thank... Your order's on its way. Okay, so các bạn dry cho nó dry đi chút xíu, lau khô nha. Tại các bạn đã giống em nói, nếu mà không có lau khô thì bộ cỏ nó sẽ cứng. So make sure you dry off the activator before you put on number four, which is the finished gel, okay? This is like the top coat, okay? So, so it will straight go to, uh-huh. And you don't want to do it, you want to do the top coat quickly because you don't want to keep swiping that back and forth. Otherwise, your brush will be hardened. Okay, and the same thing here. Okay, tại cái móng này nó dài quá, em phải làm hai ba lần nó mới đều. As you can see, it's really bóng, <laughs> really shine, bóng. <laughs> it's really bóng. It's really bóng. Oh my god. Okay. So give it a few seconds because you just apply one coat. Usually after you apply um, five nails, then you can always go back and do the another coat. 
Uh, Eye of the Beholder, she said, or they said, those are beautiful butterflies. Oh. Yeah, they're really pretty. They come in a set of 13. I think we, we mentioned them last time, but they come together as a set. And they're so pretty, you guys, at this. They have blue, they have so many different, they're all kind of like holographic, and they all have different colors. It's pink, purple, blue, silver, they have a rainbow one. Um, there's like greens and orange. Uh, they're really, really beautiful. And they're butterflies, so they come in different um, sizes. So you can have the small one, the big one, and it's just kind of like a two-piece kind of sticker if that makes sense so each wing is separate of its own and you can just adhere it the way you'd like so if you guys are interested in that product just head over to our website um, because it comes with a set honestly and it's really easy just to just buy as a set so you have um, a great set of stickers but in different colors okay guys this is it I hope you can like this look and this tutorial for today um dipping is something new i hope you learn something and you i encourage you i encourage you to give it a shot because i feel like as a nail tech you want to become a really good artist you have to try everything i feel like that's the key so it usually by the time you apply you know 10 nails is pretty much dry you, you average you takes about it takes about two to three minutes to for it to set but you can see the top coat is really nice and glossy right it's so. very sticky, mm -hmm. very sticky, mm -hmm. and then it dries, mm -hmm. and it'll be perfect. Mm -hmm. Yeah, nếu mà các bạn thích thì cho em biết nhé. Nên nếu mà các bạn muốn coi những cái design hoặc là những cái tip làm dipping nữa thì cho em biết nhé để cho em có thể uh, nhiều cơ hội chia sẻ những cái uh, um, tip mới hoặc là cũng có cho em một cơ hội để đi học hỏi thêm những cái different tips and techniques as well. So yeah, thank you so much, guys. Thank you for your time. Like always, come back to us weekly on Tuesday and Thursday uh, between, you know, a little bit around 7.30, 7.30-ish. <laughs> I feel like sometimes, um, you know, we have a little bit, you know, take probably take a little longer to set up because we have such a high production with lighting and camera. So be patient with us. Uh, and don't forget to like the on YouTube to like the page, uh, the live, and subscribe. Right, con? Cảm ơn các bạn rất nhiều và các bạn thích thì các bạn trở lại mỗi tuần vào ngày thứ ba và thứ năm khoảng chừng bảy giờ rưỡi để có uh, chúng mình, uh, các bạn và em cùng tương tác và học hỏi và chia sẻ. Đây là cũng một cơ hội để cho em học hỏi rất là nhiều. Tại vì những cái gì em chia sẻ thì em phải uh, bổ túc thêm và học hỏi thêm thì đây là cũng một cách cho em chia sẻ với các bạn và các bạn vừa em vừa có thể chia sẻ để và cũng uh, một cách để các bạn tương tác với em và có thể support cái channel này nhiều cách là các bạn có thể like và subscribe hoặc là mua những sản phẩm mà có on the nail tip shop để cho chương trình càng ngày càng phong phú hơn nhé cảm ơn các bạn rất nhiều uh, it's the end, almost the end of the week I hope you guys enjoy your weekend and be safe out there you guys thank you everyone don't forget to subscribe and follow us uh, yes, thank you and for showing us another amazing design, especially with dip powder because typically we do something with acrylic, but this time we're doing something a little different. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. We um, get inspiration also from you guys when you guys comment down below and you guys tell us exactly what you guys want to see. So make sure to keep doing that. Let us know what you are looking for when you come here. It makes it so much more fun for us and for you so you can we can both learn. Um, today we had a couple of deals. I'm going to go over them. Um, um, we had the buy, or sorry, three and one bits. You buy two and then you get one for one dollar. Come on, guys. So easy. Just add three to your cart. Then we have um, our stickers, which is buy three, um, get one free. This was a deal that we had a while ago. We're bringing it back so you guys can get all your stickers, okay? And then also something that we didn't mention was actually rhinestones are buy one, get one half off right now. So we have rhinestone sets, the crystal sets, and if you buy one, you get one half off. And as always, transfer foil sets. You guys love this. I mean, you love this. You, we've sold out on the luxury brand transfer foil set so many times, but we're bringing it back in stock for you guys. And we added another multi-brand luxury set, and it's um, we have two different ones. So there are multiple brands in that set alone, from Balenciaga to Supreme to Nike to YSL. 
we have it all okay so if you guys are interested in getting some transfer foil with so many different types of brands and we even have florals and butterflies right now it's buy three get one free so again just add that last one add three then add one more so add four and get that last one for free super easy you guys so just head over to our website at www.thenailtipshop.com if you have any questions you need to call us and you have having any issues you can actually call our number at 909-342-0078 and i think that's it thank you guys again for tuning in today i hope you guys are gonna have a great weekend please stay safe and if it's really hot where you're at i hope you find a pool nearby you okay <laughs> all right you guys thank you for tuning in we'll be back on tuesday um yeah see you later or take a dip on your neighbors <laughs> <laughs> they neighbors pool okay guys thank you so much Ciao, bye, -bye. bye. Oh, so